Hey, good evening. Uh, it's been a pretty productive evening just taking care of things in the garden. Uh, one thing I thought I'd highlight tonight is uh, one of the organic methods we use to uh, kind of fertilize or help our vegetables along. Kind of highlighted this in another video, but um, what I'm making now is, um, or while I'm making um, smoothies out of the uh, tops of the carrots that we are in the middle of processing. Um, you can compost these but it, um, to help speed the breakdown of this organic matter and make the nutrients that are in this foliage, carrot foliage here, are readily available. Uh, I've got a, I think, $15, $16 blender. And what I'm doing is just uh, shredding carrots, but... Uh, we're making a little smoothie for the plants. So whether, um, you know, that the microorganisms break this stuff down or whether I break it down, it doesn't matter as long as it gets broken down. And again, this will just kind of speed things up. And it would be kind of like a slow release fertilizer because I get a little three gallon kitty litter pail. We use kitty litter pail to mix things in. But anyway, I um, make about three gallons of this however I need. I've got a, an old uh, cottage cheese container that I use to just kind of get a bunch of that. And then I take it over to my plants and I pour it on, you know, around the base of the plant for an absorb and then over the next few weeks or so, um, as I water the garden, not only will I get some, uh, a boost from this organic matter initially, but as I water it and it continues to break down, it will continue to release nutrients into the soil. I don't know if carrot tops, I mean you can use about anything, but uh, carrots thought would be good. I mean there's a book out that says Carrots Love. I think the title is Carrots Love Tomatoes. It's about companion planting, so I figured, well, we'll try carrot tops. See if our tomatoes like carrot tops. So I'm using the carrot tops. I'm also... Using some compost here. And this is pretty much ready to go. I mean, it's chunks, but I uh, just take two handfuls of that and crumple it up in my pail here. It just kind of dissolves into this mixture. And then again, I'm going to take this around using either the ladle I have there or the, the uh, cottage cheese container and um, give my plants a little TLC. So. That's just one of the things we do to kind of keep things going. So uh, I guess that's it.